Good evening, ladies, as well as gentlemen. Papa Boris here with another Coin Crypt video. I am learning that there's a lot about this game I don't quite understand yet, uh, especially with the gods and the invisible walls and stuff like that. But we're just going to keep on playing, just taking a look through the classes. I was told that Ghost is very good, so it gets more loot and more stacks. I'm not exactly sure what that means. Like, are you more likely to get stacks or what? But anyway, the disadvantage is it drops coins. So the, pre the thief also gets more loot and it has six hit points. The ghost has, I believe, 10 hit points. However, it's advantage that it drops coins sometimes. Yeah, it's got 10 hit points. So it seems like it's pretty fair, you know, you drop coins over time, but you, you get more coins. Okay, that's a little bit overkill. Let's not do that. Okay, oh, okay, I don't want to do that. I dropped a coin. You know what? I should have just, I clearly should have just killed that thing the first time I had the overkill because I ended up losing more coins. Okay, so it seems to drop coins in battle. Um, so I'd rather have shields than coin drops. I thought maybe it like dropped coins. Maybe maybe it drops coins out on the world. I don't know. Eh? Is that a false wall? Nope. It's just weird art. Okay. I dropped a coin. Okay, so the more stacks, clearly, that, that just means that the coins tend to pile up uh, in your in, in your in your draws more so than usual. Don't have any coins to give away to that deity. Let's steal some coins, though. Um, Jesus, that's a lot of shields. That is a lot of shields. I just got an insane amount of shield. It's so much shield, it's not even showing how much it is. Okay, I do have healing in here somewhere. So... Yeah, well, uh, this ghost, I was told it was, like, a really good class. Maybe it is. But, oh jeez, wow, I'm getting a lot of coins from this chest. The heck? Right, well, I'm not gonna complain. I'm not even gonna take these these money coins, honestly. Let's just take a bunch of attack stuff and uh, make sure we're, we're set to go for the times ahead. I think the ghost gets even more coins from chests than the thief does. I think the thief, I mean, the thief only gets three coins per little chest. I'm getting four here. Pretty exciting. Oh, I don't have a regular key, that's too bad. I have a secret secret key, but not a regular key. Now I can still die, I gotta be a little bit careful here. Um, but four health, so you know, being all ghost-like doesn't mean I can't just get smashed to bits. There's two gigantic ass chests. Um, that is a way to get lots of money down there. Unfortunately, no key that I can see over here. Let's heal up, before we get started, let's steal some coins, I think that should go, oh, that doesn't quite kill him. But that'll kill him, alright, good. Yeah, I just love how in this game, you know, what your enemy has, you can, you, 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 you just take after you kill them. That's so cool to me. Because I, I remember playing like, you know, Baldur's Gate back in the day, and be like, oh, but that guy was wearing... That, that, that guy was wearing full plate mail. Why can't I take the full plate mail off his corpse? And in Coin Crypt, you could take everything off their corpses. That chest looks gigantic. Holy gods. Heal status? That could be good. We'll take one of those. Hit one. No thanks. Hit four. Sure. Steal the coin. Drop a coin. That's awful. Oh, this is actually really awkward. There's not enough good coins here. We're gonna, we're gonna take the hit ones, I guess. And um, let them stack up. Is that a shop up here? Yeah, it's a shop. I don't have any money. I elected strategically not to take any of the rare coins and just focus on attacking coins. We'll see if I have to pay for my insolence later. Good attacking and shielding, this is great. Looks like we'll have a couple of fights in a row here. This game is ostensibly turn-based, but there is Okay, that enemy is not gonna attack me. Oh, okay, there it goes. But it is, there is definitely a, a real-time component here to this game. Because, you know, sometimes you gotta look at the situation and, and use the right coin. Wow, that guy had a lot, what, nine coins? Holy ball sack, Christ. All right, definitely want these. Hit two to six, those are good, sure. What is that? Steel coin? Nah, nah, nah. Alright, let's just take a shield to wrap things up. Do I have anything I could throw away in there just for a little bit of healing? Any stupid coin? I've actually got pretty good coins. Nothing that 
Oh, yeah, boost speed. That's, that's stupid. Let's give that away. That healed me up for nine. Wow. I guess you don't have to put that many coins into the floor to get some good healing out of it. There's a shop over there, so we need to go over there. Um, let's take a bunch of hit coins. All right, I'm doing pretty well coin-wise. He's going to die in one hit. So I steal all of his coins. It looks like the one that they're, like, in the middle of casting, you also get. You also steal when the battle ends, which is nice. Ah, got to the chest before he attacked me. Good. I don't know what that thing was, but it died very quickly and had two really good coins. So I will not complain. All right, let's see if we can get to the chest. Can I avoid this guy? Nope, can't avoid him. But he, oh, he's got a, this guy is the one with like the crazy big shield. All right, die, 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 die. Thank you. Yeah, it's crazy shield and a bunch of those attack fours. Okay, so I guess I'm glad I fought him because he got, he gave me a bunch of attack coins to use. Okay, fighting another guy here. Let's go ahead and steal up. So this guy has the status, reverse hit and heal. So any, anything I hit him with will actually um, heal him rather than hurting him. I just died. Well, I don't know what I could do actually. I didn't get, I didn't, I, maybe, you know, I just took too many attack coins. That's the problem, I, I needed shields. I needed shields or heals and I didn't get those. I got the attackers. So anyway, yeah, the ghost is very interesting. I think I like the thief more overall. It doesn't get as many extra coins as the ghost does, but you're not dropping coins all the time and it just feels a little bit more straightforward. The, the getting more stacks thing is kind of weird because it really screws you up sometimes. I, I prefer actually not having that. But anyway, we'll see as the game develops. I'm sure people will find out if the ghost is like ZOMG broken overpowered or just another average class. But either way, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed our foray with the ghost and I'll see you next time with another class and some more gameplay. Take care.